Well, hey guys, Dakota Temples here. Um, yes, I am sick, so I stayed out of school today. Um, that's why I look like crap probably right now. I don't know. Um, I just want to show you my basic crappy and brim setup here. And yes, I am shirtless. Um, it's basically just a slings Zebco slingshot. Cheap rod we picked up in Donaldsonville, not from Walmart, but from a bait and little bait and tackle shop where you can buy minnows and stuff. Uh, it's got eight pound test, I think, eight pound, ten pound test on it. Um, it's a lightweight. It takes eight to twelve pounds. Um, it's five foot six. It's It's medium, it's medium light. Um, the lure weight it could take is one fourth to five eight ounces, which I ain't ever going to be using that anyways. If I'm jigging crappy, I might use, but, um, just a good little blue reel here. And you know, it's not, it's not, it's not bad. It only costs nine or ten dollars i mean you ain't gonna need some outcast rock just to go go uh crappy fishing um this is all and i like to uh crappy fish with uh all i got is just a little stinger hook um by mustad and it's got and just hook a minnow or like I said if I fish for brim with this you just hook a worm on there um and not gonna say this ain't just gonna catch bad uh crappy and brim this will catch if you put a minnow or a worm on there it'll catch bass uh southern pike you know all that and it, I mean you can't help what you catch off of it but that's what I mostly would use it for that's what I'm gonna try to catch off of it and about maybe a foot up the line here. Um, not even a foot. We got a split shot weight. And then a foam. And then now, my foot size probably up the line um we got a foam bobber uh for crappy fishing for crappy and brim i don't like to use oh crap i don't like to use a um i don't like to use a big round plastic bobber if i'm fishing for pike Yes, you will see me using a big round plastic bobber, but if I'm fishing for crappy or something, or brim, I'm going to use this. It's a whole lot lighter and more sensitive to the touch. And it's easy to take off, and it's, and it's reusable. Um, but yeah, basically that's... Just my um basic crappy brim setup spin cast rod. Uh it's made in China if if in if that bothers any of y'all or in case y'all are wondering or something. Um and it's light blue and it's like I said, it's made by Zebco. It is a Zeb product uh, ultra it's a ultra smooth wide range drag you just turn that knob and like I said that drag ain't crappy at all uh, the handle it sticks in there every two years you might want a uh you might want to tighten down that handle 
and hidden on the reel is a little place to put your hook. So you just you take your hook and it goes right in there. I just put new line on it. And uh, guys, basically, that's all right there is uh, the rod. It's got a foam handle, nice action, light to the touch, and sets the hook on fish that easy. It's not that hard. Um, all right, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe. Comment in the comment section down below. And uh, happy fishing. Peace.